Hey, welcome. You're watching Reviews of Mine, and this is a review video based on a lot of mixed feelings people around the internet, on the internet, have about up level rewards. I have gone through this already back two months ago, 60 days to be exact. Right now, I'm a little over a month um, in completing this because of the time delay in these offers crediting. So I will be a little bit more elaborative elaborative in that. Right now, I need to, for my own sake and purpose of recording this video, put a disclaim out there. I am in no shape, way, or form being paid to promote. I am not affiliated or partnered with any of these companies, especially the offer deals that are here on the website. Um, so I'm going to pre-frame this also by showing you my exact testimonial, uh, given that I posted this back in November. I have it here on their Facebook profile page. I also uploaded a video, but I'm trying to say photo. Um, uploaded a photo of this about a week or so ago, and I'm going to show you the exact email that I used to screenshot this from right in here. So I had this prepared so I can actually show you guys what the reward emails look like. These are credit has arrived, so meaning that all of the offers I had to uh, complete were systematically and automatically credit. Some were manually credit. I'll explain why a little later. Right now, I wanted to show you this is that email. So we have some dates here I'm going to pull up. We have the 23rd of October. You can actually see it right here in this email. So let's view this ticket. Maybe it will... I'm not sure. So this is not the page I'm looking for. So I'll just actually click on this email here. Reason I'm showing you this because I want people to see how very legitimate and uh, provable <laughs> this really is. Okay, um, so there's a rewards claim process. I actually I was going to show you this email, but I'd rather just go ahead and do that now. Uh, coming down here, scrolling, I had to submit valid identification. I used my state ID. I also had to upload a document, any eligible document they ask for, meaning that if it's eligible, obviously, you know, it'll be an acceptable, acceptable towards verifying who you are. Okay, so we're going to come from here. This is basically the email I failed at when it came to trying to verify my identification the first time. So I've gone through this a second time and I had to resubmit my information, of course, and it went through. So that's what this is all about here. Going forward, this is the exact email that was sent to me going through the claims process. I'm actually going to um, pull up a video. I'm also going to upload it to my YouTube channel so you guys can actually watch this less than four minutes or under four minutes to be exact. Um, so basically, it's just telling you that me at the time that I need Vela ID, but this applies to any person who goes through the requirements of Offerdale's for the level uh, reward amount that they're aiming for. So if you're going to go for any one of these here, finish five deals for a 500 level. These actually apply to the 500, 750, and $1,000 reward amount. Um, right now, I'm four deals away, and I'll just show you in a second. But right now, I just kind of want to take my time and go through this as efficiently and timely as possible. I don't want this to be a 20-minute video, so I'm going to you know, try to cover as much ground as I can and be very transparent and thorough in my ability to do so. Um, so I wanted to show you that amount here. So right now, every green mark circle indicates that I've completed the required number of offer deals. I just literally had one manually credit yesterday. So that's why that's green marked or check marked. Right now, I'm in the process of having three offer deals manually credit because a lot of these offers did not credit as they were supposed to. They're instantly credited to your account. But if they don't go through the um, they don't credit after five days, submit a manual credit. They are very prompt and very um, secure about that. And is that all right? So the video I wanted to show you was this one here. Actually, I just found this and I wanted to kind of rewind all the way back here to show you exactly what was going um, What was the process like me going through to from the start, the middle, and to the end. So this was back in October 23rd, and I can actually show you the timestamp for that. 
um uh, maybe not here it's somewhere here i probably practically i'll show you somehow somewhere so right now uh probably just like this play for three minutes but All right, so we are done with that now. I've showed you the exact process that I went through. This was recorded back at October, October 23rd, I believe. So we're gonna come back to my email account and show you that exact email. And you can see here that was time stamp and dated for the exact date that I just mentioned. All right, so I've gone through verifying, validating my identification. Uh, I use the bank statement as far as an eligible document. Going forward, fast forwarding from here, we are looking at that email that was sent to me. So I was actually at work one day. This was a little, I think, I believe a day or so um, when I received my word. I said it took me three days, so I think it just literally took me a day, a day or two. But I got that email while I was at work um, in my office, and... Uh, it's just the same email. One second here. Okay. Your reward from up lovers reward is on the way. You can't, you cannot say this is fake. Congratulations. Jasmine's my first name. Um, wanted to highlight this. So yeah, in five to seven business days, you will receive an email with your reward. We do not require any additional documents from you at this time. Okay, so we don't need to read the other part. It just congratulated me. But there it is. Simple as that, guys. All right? Simple as that. Now, what I'm going to go further to show you 
Let's see, is that actually I have that pulled up? I'm tripping. I don't want to pull up a duplicate uh, tab here and I have it. Okay. So let's let this load and you will see that Tremendous is the third party vendor, which is completely in black stated here at the very bottom. Okay. So we want to hide this little bar here. 21. What happens if I do not receive my reward in the time provided? So what I did, I had to actually search for this earlier. Um, but I'm using the shortcut key, control F to pull up the search bar to find tremendous, which is right there. Tremendous. You will receive an email from tremendous, allowing you to select your reward, which I gone through and I don't have video of that, but I can tell you, you know, from my own personal experience in my own mouth that I was given two options to choose in the form of the hundred dollar gift card, a virtual or a physical card. And obviously I'm going to choose digital because it's an instant email digital uh digitalized code that was sent to me okay so that stated there and for transparency reason i need to also show you this chart simple as that you see it here as well see reward options okay and coming back here to show you my gift card let's scroll up here there's my name here are the dates on the side here. These are transaction, felt transactions I was using at the time I was playing some games and I just did it for the sake of trying to kill my bottom, I suppose, but had nothing to do with, you know, in our trying to complete another offer. I was outside of once I received my gift card, but you can see here on the next page, there's a hundred dollar gift card at the time it was active, okay? And I submitted this through, um, not submitted, but I uploaded my, I'm using the wrong terminology right now. I added my debit card, my my virtual debit card onto my PayPal account. I'm able to do that. You can too, once you've gone through the process, the steps and attain, um, require the number of deals completed, you need to complete in order for you to obtain this virtual or physical gift card. So guys, it's not that, it's not that difficult at all. All right. And to validate that again, this is my own personal response and testimonial. I'm done. I hope this is thorough. Um, the only thing I will notate is that when you're going through these offers, what I did mention, I might as well tell you now before I conclude this video. When you're doing offer deals, you want to have pen and paper handy. Reason being is because if you decide to plan this out, and I highly recommend you do this ahead of time, you're going to, you know, say maximize your reward efforts wanting to receive a thousand dollar gift card which i'm trying to do right now i notated everything that i did as far as writing down offer deals those that i had to cancel which you know they could be trial offers they can be subscription packages some will tell you how to call in to cancel or you need to log in which is something i'm going to notate as well to write down the email address and, and the password created if required for some of these different offers so that you will have something to work on refer back to you're going to need this as a reference later on definitely notate down the offer deals write down the exact uh, password and email address used if you decide to use the same email address for say seven or eight different offer deals um also write down the last four digit of a debit card i highly recommend you do that as well some will ask you for a debit card it's not to charge your card it's to have it on file to you know validate you know that if you decide to actually proceed past the trial, they're going to charge you. But of course, nobody wants to do that. That's why I recommend you, what I'm telling you right now to just go ahead, write down the last four digits of the debit card or credit card number you're going to use. Also write down the um, date you're starting these offers and then write down the expiration date, the deadline when the trial expires. This is going to help you save some of stress, frustration and energy for you having to feel that you didn't take control or you didn't take immediate action on canceling these different subscription offers and, and trial offer deals, all right? Please just do yourself the um, savor the, the energy, okay? Just save the damn energy, really. Um, if there's anything else I did not cover, please leave it down in the comments. I will respond. I did my best to try to elaborate as well as to, uh, thoroughly go through everything to clarify that this company pays. All right. And, you know, some background here. I got paid through tremendous various times. I know they pay because they're using 
flash rewards I'm referring to. They're using Tremendous as a third party vendor to um, send out these different gift reward amounts. And I'm expecting another gift card through this company again, given that I was in a Google Meet, uh, focus, not a focus group, but a Google Meet uh live conference today early this morning so i don't get that for another three to five days but you know you heard it from me nobody else again i am not in a way shape or form being paid to promote talk about this i'm not affiliated or no partner with these companies this is my own personal review you've seen a video i did this the first time around and i'll conclude that you guys have a great rest of your day and stay safe peace out <laughs>